Now, water north of the equator swirls counterclockwise. South of the equator, it swirls clockwise. I'll show you. Here's a video experiment. This, they put a sink right on top of the equator. This is in Ecuador. Anybody can go down there. They drew a line on the concrete right there behind the person. This is the equator. They're going to pour water in the sink and let it drain on the equator. <clears throat> now watch. Straight down. Okay. Now let's pick up the sink. Go south of the equator. 15 feet. Plug the sink, fill it with water, let it stabilize a minute. Ready, guys? Yep. Pull the plug, drop some leaves in. Why does it swirl south of the equator and not swirl on the equator? It's called the Coriolis effect, because the Earth is spinning. Now let's take it north of the equator, 15 feet away from the equator. You can Google, I forget the name of this thing, but just Google, does water swirl north or south of the equator? It comes up with a bunch of video clips of this kind of stuff. Okay, we're gonna fill the sink with, with water. It's gonna swirl the other direction, I promise you. Pull the plug, drop in the leaves, and it swirls counterclockwise north of the equator.